Okay, so let's have this topic. So solving for the area under the normal curve. So using this table, the Z table, to solve for the area of the normal curve. But take note that the area of this table starts from the mean. So we have this given, so find the area under the standard normal distribution curve. So we have Z equals 0 and Z equals 0 0.74. So in the curve, this is the mean and that's Z equals 0. Then we also have this uh, Z equals 0 0.74. So let's assume that this one is 0 0.74. Now since we're looking for the area between 0 and 0 0.74, so therefore, this area is the unknown. So to solve for this area using the Z table, so we need to find the area of this 0 0.74. So we have Z, then points uh, 7 and point 0, 04 so that's 0 0.74 so you connect to get the area of 0 0.74 so that's 0 0.2704 now since the area of this table starts from the mean and this is the mean so therefore this 0 0.2704 belongs to this area so the area now is equal to 0 0.27 Zero 04. Then for this given, so z equals 0 and z equals negative 1.21. So this is z equals 0 and let's assume that this one is negative 1.21. So find the area between, so therefore, this area is the unknown. So to solve for this area, Using this Z table, so we need to find the area of this negative 1.21. So in finding the area of a negative Z, so just ignore the negative. So we have uh, 1.2, then 0 0.01, so that's 1.21. Then you connect. So therefore, the area of negative 1.21 is 0 0.3869 now since this area uh, starts from the mean and this is the mean so therefore this 0 0.3869 belongs to this area so the area now is 0 0.3869 then for this given so to the right of 1.27 so let's assume that this one is 1.27 then find the area to the right so therefore this area is the unknown that's the right of 1.27 so first we need to find the area of z equals 1.27 using the z table so we have 1.2 then 0 0.07 that's 1.27 then you connect so the area of 1.27 that's 0 0.3980 now since starts from the mean and this is the mean so therefore this 0.3980 belongs to this area but this area is unknown so using the properties of normal distribution that the total area of a curve is equal to 1 so therefore half of the curve, the area is 0.5. So to solve now for this area, so we have this uh, 0.5, then minus this area, which is equal to uh, 0.3980. So the area now is equal to 0 0.102. Then for this given, so to the left of z equals negative 1.32. So let's assume that this one is negative 1.32. Then to find the area of this negative 1.32. So we have 1.3. Then 0 0.02, that's negative 1.32. So the area now of this negative 1.32 is 0.4066. 
since starts from the mean and this is the mean so therefore this 0.4066 belongs to this area but on the problem we're looking for the area to the left of negative 1.32 so therefore this one is the unknown so again from the properties of a normal distribution the total area of a curve is equal to 1 so therefore the area of half of the curve that's 0.5 so to solve now for this area so we have this 0.5 then minus this area that's 0.466 so the area now is equal to 0 0.0934 then for this problem, so between uh, z equals negative 2.15 and z equals negative 1.47, so let's assume that this one is negative 2.15 and this one is negative 1.47, then solve for the area between, so this area is the unknown. Then uh, we need to solve first the area of negative 2.15 and this negative 1.47. So, in the table, so this uh, negative 2.1, then 0.05, that's 2.15. Then you connect. So, the area now of this negative 2.15, that's 0.4842. And the area of negative 1.47, so 1.4, uh, 0.07, so you connect. So the area now is negative 1.47, that's 0.4292. Since the area starts from the mean, this is the mean, and this one is a negative 1.47. So therefore, this 0.4292 belongs to this area. But this area is the unknown, and from the mean to negative 2.15, that's 0.4842, so therefore, this one is 0.4842. So to solve for this area, and that's 0 0.4842, then minus this area, that's 0 0.4292, so the area now is equal to 0 0.055. Then for then for this given, so between z equals a negative 72 and z equals 1.35, so let's assume that this one is negative 0.72 and this one is 1.35. So solve first the area of negative uh, 0.72 and the area of 1.35. So in the table, so we have this 0.7, then 0.02, that's 0.72. So the area of negative 0.72 that's 0.2642 then for this uh, 1.3 then 0 0.05 that's 1.35 so the area of 1.35 that's 0.4115 now since the area starts from the mean and this is the mean this one is negative 0 0.72 so therefore this 0 0.2642 belongs to this area and also this one is the mean this one is 1.35, so therefore this 0.4115 belongs to this area. Then since we're looking for the area between, so therefore this area is unknown. So to solve for the total area, so we have this uh, 0.2642 then plus 0.4115, so the area now is equal to 0 0.67. 5, 7. Then for this given, so to the right of z equals negative a point 90. So let's assume that this one is negative a point 90. Then to solve for the area of this negative point 90, so point uh, 9. Then this one is 0. So therefore, the area of negative point 90, the 0 0.3159. Now since starts from the mean, this is the mean, and this one is negative 0.90, so therefore this 0 0.3159 belongs to this area. Now in the problem, so we need to find the area to the right of negative 0.90, 
And this is the right of this uh, negative point 90. Now, since the area of half of the curve is uh, 0.5, so the total area now, that's 0 0.5, 10 plus 0 0.3159, so the area now is equal to 0 0.8159.